Hey, good day to you and thanks for tuning in. Um, recently, I talked about the neurosensory aspect of the lacrimal function unit uh, and how that's something I think for a long time we've overlooked, but now there's actually a medication, Oxervate, that we can use to help those patients that have um, corneal nerves that are essentially gone numb. I want to update you. I've got a, saw a patient back just last week who's been on this medication uh, for about four weeks. And she's a patient that we could just never get the cornea looking good. If I poke her in the eye with a wisp, uh, she doesn't feel it. Somehow, oddly enough, her OSDI 46, very high. So very symptomatic. Um, perhaps it was the visual portion of that uh, that was affecting her. But she had a numb cornea. So put her onto the medication. And a month later, saw her back. Her corneal staining profoundly better. Um, as a side note, her OSDI went from a 46 to 10. So I've got to try to figure that out. Uh, again, maybe that's visual. I'm not sure. But but one thing I want to comment about this sort of orphan drug that uh, can be very expensive if you don't have coverage. And a lot of pharmaceutical companies have programs in place to help practices with prior authorizations and finding best ways to get patients on medications that affordably. I want to give a shout out to Don't Pay's Connect to Care. It's phenomenal. They actually have somebody who will handhold or help your patient through that journey and your staff. So they'll communicate directly with your patient. They will look at them from a financial standpoint. Most of my patients are paying about $50 for the eight-week treatment. So the drops are six times a day for eight weeks, and then you can stop. And The studies show that 80% of those patients still have a clear cornea a year later don't have enough experience yet to say what will happen if it comes back at that point. Maybe they go through another um, round of treatment. But again, this connect to care program uh, really has taken the burden away from my practice and patients love it, that they have someone that they can talk to who can walk them through the entire process. It's not the same thing as phone it to a pharmacy, pay and go pick it up. There's more to it than that. But they assist. So I'm very impressed with what Don't Pay Pharma has done. Uh, and for full disclosures, I'm a speaker for them, uh, but primarily because I'm such a fan of what they're doing.